hello everyone hope you are doing well uh, guys as usual today i came again with one more video uh, about hp printer right now you can see in front of your screen uh, there is hp smart tank model 515 and this is a new model from hp and this is the ink tank technology uh, you can see there is uh, three colors on the left side and the one is black on the right side this is the ink tank printer guys Mm, it's good economically if you want to use uh, uh, you have consumption of papers uh, mostly a day uh, in a day around 100 to 200 or m more than this so it's very worth uh, to buy this printer uh, uh, right now the problem with that printer is it's not feeding the paper well and uh, i will show you what is the problem and how to fix this uh, first of all welcome to smart tech guys uh, hope you are doing uh, well and uh, you are uh, watching my videos uh, and i am getting your feedbacks uh, uh, every time in the comments uh, guys uh, this printer is on right now okay i will give the command okay for copy you will see uh, let's see you can see first of all the voice look here look it's it's not feeding well and from the right side it's uh, feeding and from the left is not feeding so it means there is a problem inside the gear or the feeder roller I will turn it off first of all I will turn it off and I will show you how to uh, fix this problem stay with me as yes, I uh, turn the power off but still it's uh, taking a bit long to turn it off guys uh, I will remove the paper from the drawer here guys uh, there is problem it's not it's not feeding from here uh, if i will show you uh, with the light uh, uh, hold on guys i uh, put the light here and this is the uh, feeding roller place where we insert the paper you can see here first of all we will see there is nothing we can find it here okay there is nothing here uh, there is nothing we can uh, the thing is visible so it means that uh, there is a problem with the feeder roller or something went inside how to see uh, first of all uh, i will guide you step by step how to find there is a thing inside uh, and how to remove this jam actually uh, first of all we have to move we have to move uh, your uh, printer uh, the downside we have to visible uh, we have to see the downside yes guys as i mentioned earlier first of all you have to see the feeding uh, place here if there is anything here you have to find it but if you can't if you couldn't found anything here you have to move this up this is the uh, downside a uh, visible front of you you can see guys uh, this is white color plate in front of you we have to open this plate second step is we have to open this uh, cover to see that if there is anything here if something stuck here we will remove it and uh, our problem will be solved this is the second step so i will remove these two locks you can see one lock is here a second is here i will remove this uh, open this lock yes, so we will uh, uncover this uh, two locks and this is now visible in front of us yes guys uh, if anything is stuck it should be appear here and you can see uh, there is a lid pencil inside this fallen mistaken i think from the upside and this is stuck that's why the printer is not feeding well so uh, we have to remove anything if you found here you have to remove these uh, thing i will remove this pencil then uh, we will close this back and check again if it is working or not yes guys uh, with the help of tuzer uh, we remove the pens pencil uh, right now you can see this was this pencil was inside now we will turn close this cover right like this okay the pencil uh, recently i removed okay so now we will check again this this is the second step guys in case if you couldn't found anything uh, if you couldn't found anything uh, the, the downside the third step is we have to check from here you can see we have to check from here also uh, we sometimes we uh, we can find uh, here uh, actually i show you with the screwdriver with the help of screwdriver so, uh, 
third if you couldn't find that anything from down you have to you have to move this uh, lock little up you can find if anything stuck here uh, write down these uh, white rollers okay if you couldn't find here also anything then guys the last step you have to uncover unassemble all the printer uh, and I will show you where is the screws uh, there are one screw is here and one screw is here uh, I am not going to open it because our problem is solved we will check now these two screws open if you couldn't find anything here and the one screw is here also and here is one after the move these four screws uh, very smoothly you can uncover uh, this upper side when you will uh, un uh, uncover it and you can find uh, the cartridges uh, roller here uh, on the down and then you can visible uh, uh, everything will be visible in front of you with very clarity so you can remove any jamming there so right now uh, I will give the command turn it on to check that either it's feeding the paper well or not before it is it was jamming so let it uh, it's turning it on guys we will give the command and see it's, it will take a bit uh, in booting this printer is good actually uh, with the passage of time just uh, uh, the cartridges uh, in this printer became uh, little weak so guys i will press copy i give the command now see the voice is also normal before there was one irritating voice now we will see still a bit voice is there but i want to see that it's feeding well or not what main issue was uh, before it was not feeding the paper yes guys it's feeding the paper now fine look you can see there is no more jam i will give the command again to make sure that it's fixed well or not there is an error what is this error about we we'll check now look it's feeding well no more jam so hope you understand uh, the method for this printer okay guys if you have any question you can ask me in the comments uh, uh, this is a new model mm, easy to fix uh, at home mm, i don't think that there is a big issue with that printer in case if you required any maintenance so it's uh, free maintenance free i think just uh, if you use it well it will not give any error or any jam so okay guys uh, hope you understand it and if you have any question you can ask me in the comments i will reply your queries uh, take care bye